Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, well, what exactly um, did Microsoft fix or not in the uh, taskbar, not the taskbar, the start menu in Windows 11 that um, people asked for or, you know, um, in I mean, we are at two years of Windows 11 now. October is when it was officially launched two years ago at 21H2. And of course, 22H2 came and uh, we're soon in the next days or weeks to have 23H2. And what do we have? Well, we have a start menu that stayed relatively the same. A few things have changed. We were able at some point to make folders out of icons, things like that. Um, but overall, there are things that they haven't fixed and that people still don't like. Um, so what's the most annoying thing for most people right now in, uh, when you look at the feedback hub? Well, they haven't changed that. They haven't done anything. They let us kind of, you know, display nothing if we want. But the recommended section is still visible. There's no way to totally remove it. And so that the start menu would readjust, for example, uh, and just have the icons for the start menu and no recommended area at all. So this is one of the most requested feature. Um, of course, it goes also with the fact that most would like to be able to resize that start area too. You know, uh, this is a backwards um, thing from Windows 10. Windows 10 lets you customize and resize the start menu like you want. You have its full screen, half screen, quarter screen, custom. You just, you know, take your mouse and play around with it. Uh, here we're stuck with a um, rectangle that is just pretty much, you know, the same. Doesn't change size, doesn't, don't, doesn't let you change size or anything. All you could do is have apps, pinned apps, and recommended section. And even if you remove a section, you still have the same size of the box, which is something people would like that it changed. Um, will this be addressed eventually in Windows 11? Anybody's guess? Because uh, there's no hint of much happening in terms of Windows 11's uh, start menu. Uh, even in the insider rings, even in the insider up to the canary, um, it stays the same and there's no real new feature coming to it. So uh, I guess we're going to have a pretty much a start menu that will display like that forever. Um, if they do address, well, we'll see, you know, there are more moments coming up, more features coming up next year. Will that be one of the addressed features? Um, it's anybody's guess, but, uh, this is definitely one of the biggest annoyances for a lot of people. Why is it that recommended section turned off? You still have that space and you still have all of it visible. Why doesn't this readjust? You know, it's, I don't think that in today's technology, it's that difficult to create boxes that resize themselves. Uh, but it seems as for Microsoft, it is. Um, would you like that? What would you like the start menu box to do? Would you like it to have readjusting itself or you could resize it yourself manually by taking, you know, the corners, for example? Uh, what would you like? I definitely would like to have this very customizable personally. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.